Number 10. Galactus made his first appearance in the Fantastic Four number 48, published in March 1966. Created by writer Stan Lee and artist Jack Kirby, Galactus is one of the most iconic and formidable villains in the Marvel Comics universe. Galactus's first storyline begins when the Silver Surfer arrives on Earth as Galactus's herald, heralding the imminent arrival of the Devourer of Worlds. Galactus's purpose is revealed, to consume the energy of Earth, leaving it a barren wasteland. The Fantastic Four, led by Mr. Fantastic, devise a plan to stop Galactus and save their planet. This storyline marks the beginning of one of the most epic battles in Marvel Comics history as the Fantastic Four face off against the cosmic threat of Galactus. Number 9. Galactus's origin is deeply rooted in the cosmic mythology of the Marvel Universe. He was originally Galen of the planet Ta, a scientist from a universe that existed before the current Marvel Universe. When this previous universe collapsed, Galen merged with the sentience of the universe and was reborn as Galactus, the devourer of worlds. As Galactus, he is a cosmic being of immense power who requires the energy of living planets to sustain himself. He travels the universe in his giant spaceship Ta, searching for suitable worlds to consume. Galactus is not inherently malevolent. Rather, he sees himself as a necessary force of balance in the cosmos, maintaining the natural order of creation and destruction. Despite his immense power, Galactus is often depicted as a tragic figure, burdened by the responsibility of his existence and the consequences of his actions. He is a recurring antagonist in Marvel Comics, frequently opposed by cosmic heroes like the Fantastic Four and the Silver Surfer, who seek to thwart his plans to consume inhabited worlds. Number 8. Galactus's armor is a means of channeling and controlling his vast cosmic power. It serves as a regulator or conduit, allowing him to focus and direct his energies as needed. However, it's important to note that Galactus's true power transcends any physical form or device. His armor is merely a tool for him to interact with the physical universe. While the armor may have limitations or vulnerabilities, it doesn't inherently diminish Galactus's power. He remains one of the most formidable beings in the Marvel Universe, capable of manipulating matter, energy, space, and even reality itself on a cosmic scale. Even without his armor, Galactus would still possess unimaginable power and be a force to be reckoned with. Number 7. Galactus has had several heralds throughout his existence in Marvel Comics. Some of the most notable ones include Silver Surfer, Norrin Rad, perhaps the most famous of all Galactus's heralds. The Silver Surfer was a former inhabitant of the planet Zenla who sacrificed himself to save his world from Galactus. In return, Galactus imbued him with the power cosmic, transforming him into his herald. Firelord, Pyreus Krill, a former member of the Nova Corps, Firelord became one of Galactus's heralds after being defeated and transformed by the cosmic entity. Terex the Tamer, Tyros a former dictator of the planet Burge, Tyros was transformed by Galactus into the cosmic-powered herald Terex. Airwalker, Gabriel Lawn, originally a humanoid android created by Galactus, Airwalker was later imbued with the power cosmic and served as one of Galactus's heralds. Nova, Frankie Ray a human woman with latent mutant abilities, Frankie Ray became Nova, another of Galactus's heralds, after willingly offering herself to him in exchange for sparing Earth. These are just a few examples, as Galactus has had other heralds in various comic storylines. Each herald typically serves as a scout, seeking out suitable planets for Galactus to consume to sustain his cosmic hunger. Number 6 Galactus is often depicted as a cosmic entity who exists to consume the energy of entire planets to sustain himself. This insatiable hunger is a fundamental aspect of his character, driving him to seek out inhabited worlds to feed upon. Despite his immense power and cosmic stature, Galactus is portrayed as being perpetually and eternally driven by this hunger, making him one of the most formidable and iconic villains in the Marvel Universe. Galactus consumes planets by using a device known as the Worldship. 
This enormous vessel is equipped with advanced technology that allows Galactus to convert the mass and energy of entire planets into sustenance that he can absorb. He typically uses a device on the world ship to drain the life force or energy from a planet, leaving it as a lifeless husk. This process, known as world devouring, allows Galactus to satisfy his insatiable hunger and maintain his immense power. Number 5. Galactus is one of the most powerful beings in the Marvel Universe, but he does have weaknesses, although they are not easily exploitable. Cosmic entities, beings on par with or stronger than Galactus, such as the Living Tribunal or the Celestials, can pose a threat to him. Cosmic Balance Galactus serves as a necessary component in the cosmic balance of the universe. Disrupting this balance could potentially weaken or defeat him. Energy Manipulation Since Galactus relies on cosmic energy, it's theoretically possible to disrupt or drain his energy, although achieving this is extremely difficult. Extreme Conditions Galactus is vulnerable to certain extreme conditions or forces, such as the Ultimate Nullifier a weapon capable of erasing entire realities. Number 4. Galactus is known for his incredible resilience and ability to regenerate from severe damage. As a cosmic being of immense power, he possesses advanced regenerative abilities that allow him to recover from injuries that would be fatal to most other beings. This is one of the factors that makes Galactus such a formidable and enduring presence in the Marvel Universe. Despite facing numerous powerful adversaries and facing near defeat on occasion, Galactus always manages to endure and continue his cosmic role. I hope you're enjoying this video. Before we get to the top 3, please could you take a moment to like and subscribe to my channel as it would be a great help. Number 3 Officially, Galactus's height is 28 feet, 9 inches, and weighs 18.2 tons. But physical size and weight can fluctuate in the comics depending on the context and narrative needs of the story. While his official height and weight have been stated in certain sources, his depiction in the comics often varies, sometimes appearing as a towering cosmic giant, and other times as a more manageable humanoid figure. Number 2. Galactus possesses a vast array of powers beyond his cosmic abilities to consume planets. Among these are his psychic and psychokinetic powers, which allow him to manipulate energy, matter, and even minds on a cosmic scale. With his psychic abilities, Galactus can probe the thoughts and memories of others, communicate telepathically, and exert mental influence over individuals and entire populations. His psychokinetic powers enable him to manipulate objects and energy with his mind, allowing him to perform feats such as levitation, telekinesis, and the projection of powerful energy blasts. Number 1. While Galactus himself is not inherently evil and often serves as a force of nature rather than a traditional villain, there are entities and characters in the Marvel Universe who have come into conflict with him due to his cosmic activities and the threat he poses to inhabited worlds. Some of the adversaries of Galactus include the Fantastic Four. As defenders of Earth, the Fantastic Four have frequently opposed Galactus's attempts to consume the planet. They often strive to find ways to repel or deter him without resorting to violence. Silver Surfer. Galactus's former herald, the Silver Surfer, has a complicated relationship with his former master. While he has sometimes aided Galactus in finding suitable planets to consume, he has also rebelled against him to protect innocent lives. Thor. As the Asgardian god of thunder, Thor has clashed with Galactus on multiple occasions, often seeking to defend Earth and other realms from his cosmic hunger. The Avengers. Earth's mightiest heroes, the Avengers, have encountered Galactus in various storylines, and have worked together to prevent him from consuming inhabited planets. The Shi'ar Empire The Shi'ar, a powerful alien empire in the Marvel Universe, has clashed with Galactus when his actions threaten their territories or allies. Ego the Living Planet Ego, a sentient and malevolent planet, 
has crossed paths with Galactus due to their conflicting desires regarding the consumption or preservation of other worlds. The Celestials, these ancient cosmic beings, who are responsible for the creation and manipulation of life across the universe, have sometimes been at odds with Galactus due to his disruption of their plans or interference with their experiments. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something from the video and we'll see you on the next one.